It's Wednesday, May 16th, and I'm down at my parents' house. Um, yesterday we had a really bad storm come through and a huge microburst came through and well, there's the house right there. You can see there's a large tree came down. We've got heavy equipment in here. We got trees that came down in the front yard. So this week I'm headed up for a short one day trip to New York to hunt some public land with my friends Lewis and Barry. Then it's back home here to Pennsylvania. Now we got a bad storm comes through and creates a lot of damage to our parents home. David and I make a decision instead to head back to New York, stay home here in Pennsylvania and that decision pays off with a punch tag. Alright well I made it to camp, Barry's here. Say hi, Barry. Oh, this is me. This is you. I didn't realize that, I was on TV. You, that is you, Barry. That is you. In case in, you want to look again and make sure that's you. Uh, yeah, yeah, that is me. That is you. Okay. You know Barry. <laughs> Barry. But uh, just got to camp. Hit some pretty nasty weather coming up here. But the guys were out this morning. And uh, this guy over here. That would be me. My uh, New York hunting buddy that I always have to track deer that he hits and we never find. It only happened once. He uh, he killed the turkey. Yes. He's pretty good about finding them when he hits them. So we're going to score this up and uh, see how it does. And listen, it was probably worth. Yeah. It was probably two more pounds heavier. Twenty, twenty and a half pounds, buddy. That's nice. That's a really nice bird. Public, public land in New York area. Yes. Yes. Thanks, Thanks buddy. Congrats, man. Awesome. Let's check it out. Fifty-nine point seven five. Cool. Just shy of sixty. Nice, buddy. Good job. It's your time. Let's go find some It's your more. time. It's his time. Barry and I are up tomorrow yeah. morning. Yeah. You guys are getting them. Let's Let's get them. Lewis, tell them the part about how I allowed you to shoot my bird. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, we're going to go roost up. <laughs> The guys and I head out that evening to try and roost some birds and put a couple to sleep for the next morning's hunt. It's not very successful, so it's time to get up the next morning, head on out, and get mobile and see what we can find. Alright, it is muggy, but we are, what we've done is we split up a little bit this morning. Barry and I are on one side of uh, a kind of a ravine. There's a swamp over here to our right and they were in here yesterday after Lewis shot his bird. He had a lot of birds gobbling so what Lewis did is he dropped us off. We walked down this road. We just got in here a little bit. We're gonna listen. He went around. He's on the other side straight across from us and uh, we're gonna see if we can't get him to gobble. <laughs> well, other than Barry, nothing really gobbled at the daybreak spot. We drove around all morning, saw some birds, but didn't get anything to gobble until this last spot. Yeah. I don't think I think we're wasting our, our time right here. I'm just gonna I'm gonna go I'm just gonna go straight up in here. 
They're going to cross right here too because they yeah. can see. They got the field here. Well, there's this trail yeah. right here that the, the hens went across and then came right yeah, and they, and they followed that trail right up. So I'm just going to walk up that trail. Yeah, perfect, perfect. Okay, all right. All right, well, we're going to pick up. These birds didn't come like we thought they would, so. Lewis is right here. We're going to move. Oh, yeah. 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 We got three hours, so let's go find another one. see a whole lot of birds but we did get into some gobbling just couldn't make it happen so before I head back home I gotta go get some soil samples from where we're gonna be planting our killer food plot up here so electric frog designs is your one-stop shop for screen printing embroidery signage and promotional products our state-of-the-art shop has all the equipment needed to make your business shine and your event a success. Project consultations are always free and Rush Turnaround is available for many items. Whether it's our full line of plaques, awards and medals, lettering a vehicle for your business or outfitting teams with uniforms, Electric Frog Designs will work closely with you to create a design that will allow you to stand out in the crowd. Call us at 570-788-2333 today. At Nightstar Munitions, we are family owned and operated. Open Monday through Saturday, selling new and used firearms in all your ammo needs. We are your superior safe dealer and specialize in AR rifles, Glock handguns, shotgun and rifle reloading supplies, and more. Stop by and see us at Nightstar Munitions. This segment brought to you by Evans Roadhouse. Pennsylvania's destination for gourmet cuisine. By Buck Cage, Cage your next buck. And by Killer Food Plots, you reap what you sow. Well, we're back in PA and David and I headed out to some public land for the final hour of the morning and the action is about to get really intense. Oh, I might have heard something here and there, but it was nothing, I guess. We walked all the way up to a power line stood up there for a while. We got about 20 minutes of legal shooting time left. So we're sneaking our way back to these fields where we saw uh, a hen and a gobbler before we walked up. Maybe they came back out, starting to get a little bright. They're gonna wanna come to the fields and dry off before rain comes again. So we're gonna sneak down here. And maybe we'll get lucky.
Well, this bird is coming. He's gobbling really good. It sounds like he's by himself, but there's a field that we didn't realize was there, and he's working along that field on the edge of the woods to our left, and it's creating a little bit of a challenge for us to get a shot with only minutes to go in the morning. Suvio's Pizzeria and Restaurant, serving the Hazleton area since 1975. Come in and try our wide variety of handmade specialty pizzas, or change it up with our fresh breadsticks, stromboli, pepperoni, and sausage rolls. Try one of our wraps or our local favorite baked Italian while relaxing in our casual seating area for a quick lunch. Can't make it in? We offer home and local industrial park delivery. Or enjoy our back dining room and a homemade Italian meal. Vesuvio's Pizzeria, where customers send their friends. This segment brought to you by Scent Blocker. Show the Shield. By Dusty W. German Short-Haired Pointers, breeding good, well-rounded, quality dogs. And by Easy Cut Products, tools made for cutting. Well, we got one to gobble. Unfortunately, with only 15 minutes of legal shooting time left, we moved quite a bit on him. They closed the distance. We thought he was in the woods. Turned out he was in this one field. He come up the edge. I saw him coming through the thick stuff in the, in the field, but this tree blocked me. David could see him, I couldn't. He come right up here. I couldn't get a shot. It stinks. We gotta leave the woods with a bird goblin that we could kill right now if we moved up on him a little bit. But legal shooting time is over, we gotta obey the law. Wish was, I wish it was a day later because Monday starts all day hunting in Pennsylvania. Dang it, that stinks. Well, those are the frustrations of spring turkey season, the ups and the downs, as you can say. If it would have been just two days later, we would have been all day hunting. We wouldn't have had to stop at noon. And David and I know for sure that if we had a chance to set up on that bird a little bit different as he walked off, we definitely would have killed that bird. Now we're gonna head back to our parents' home. A few days after this hunt, we had a bad storm come through and a tree fell down and created a lot of damage on our parents' homestead. Mom and Dad's house, May 15, 2018. Severe storms came through, completely uprooted this tree from the ground into the house, took out the deck, the chimney. Wednesday, May 16th, and I'm down at my parents' house. 
Um, yesterday we had a really bad storm come through and a huge microburst came through and well, there's the house right there. You can see there's a large tree came down. We've got heavy equipment in here. We've got trees that came down. Front yard. That's where it came up. It just uprooted the big oak. It's been here for years. It just uprooted it completely. Go right on the house. Collapsed the chimney. Heavy damage to the roof. Well, this is our homestead. This is where David and I grew up with our brothers, uh, Stephen and Joe, and we spent a lot of good times here and still do. But to see this tree uproot, fall down on the house was something that we'll never forget. Thankfully, mom and dad were both okay and we can fix the house. But we were gonna go to New York for a few days. We decided not to, to stay close to family. And we head out two mornings later and we have a little bit of a bright spot that finally comes our way. Welcome to Zanellini's Garage. In need of summertime yard tools? Check out our full line of Red Max products and Toro push mowers. You prefer sitting on those big lawn jobs? We have a large line of Skag zero turn mowers to choose from. And don't let the winter keep you down. We carry Toro snow blowers to clear your way. You're cold? No worry with a western snowplow on the front of your truck. Stop in and see us at Zanellini's Garage. When it's too cold for camping, we go camping. When it's too hot to work, we work. Too wet to keep going? Nah. This is the Gator XUV835 with game-changing heat and air and three wide seating. It's never too anything for anything. Nothing runs like a deer. Check out the Gator SUVs and all the John Deeres at Lindsay Equipment on Hazelton Street in Ashley and always on the web at lindsayequipmentus.com. Is pain cramping your outdoor lifestyle? At the Jesus Family Chiropractic, you can take back your life. With a combined 50 years of experience providing exceptional chiropractic care using the latest advanced technology and techniques, we're the only office in Northeast PA certified to provide Platinum 4 K-Laser Therapy, the most advanced therapeutic laser available to help with many conditions. Together with chiropractic and K-Laser Therapy, we can help you without the use of any dangerous drugs or surgery. So why not get back in the game? Call the Jesus Family Chiropractic today for a free consultation. This segment brought to you by Altera Alpaca Performance Socks, proudly made in the USA. By Insights Honey, show your antler with quality products built right. And by Raptor Razor Knives, cut your field dressing time in half. Just don't move. He's 50 yards to my left in the woods. He's in the woods? Yeah. I cannot see him. He's directly down from these pines. Uh, he's directly down from these pines. I, uh, I can't see him. There's a tree, a big tree blocking me. Uh, you're actually blocking me right now with the camera. I can't. I don't know if I can get between your head and the tree. There's nothing I can do. Where's he at? I don't know. It sounds like he's behind a tree. He's right behind you. Yeah, that's what it sounds like. He's down here to my left somewhere, but I don't know where he is. Right now, I don't just give. 
have some soft calls. See what happens. <laughs> oh my That's god. That's awesome. <laughs> I just dropped my mouth call. Oh my god, I don't know where it is. <laughs> Holy cow. I don't know if he's a long beard or not. Well, he is goblin like one, that's for sure. I can't, this bird has a small beard. <sighs> but it's the only bird that came out here. This might be a Jake. I think the long beard might have been back there, but. This bird came out and put on a show for us a little bit. I don't know. <laughs> nice, nice, buddy. Stuff. Let's go check him out. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh. Yeah, this is a Jake. You got it. Got about a four inch beard on him. <laughs> nice job, buddy. Nice, buddy. Move this out of the way. <laughs> yeah, he's definitely not the guy that was goblin, but that guy was hanging up behind us. And this bird came out. Our parents' home got damaged by some pretty bad storms on Tuesday. And uh, David and I were supposed to be in New York hunting this morning and you know we 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 just we can't we can't go that far away from from home and know that our parents ho our home parents home is not the best shape and uh we want to stay close to home to take care of things and make phone calls and whatnot you know so a lot of work to do you know we just we just said let's stay home we're gonna hunt do our best here and uh, Paid off so far. This will put a smile on their face. Absolutely. Absolutely.